I mean, number one thing I guess I like is you. Me? <laughs> Hi, what's your name? Dave. Uh, where are you from? Seattle. Is you down here to Malaysia? Uh, my wife is from here. Oh, okay. Did you meet her here or back in the U.S.? Back in the U.S. Is this your first time here to Malaysia? Second time. Okay, and what do you like about here so far? Uh, I mean, it's, uh, let's see, what do I like? I mean, it's all new to me, so I'm, mm -hmm. I'm a traveler, so I like going to new places. Um, I've yet to explore, uh, it's usually a launching point to other yeah. places in Southeast Asia, but mm -hmm. the food, I mean, number one thing I guess I like is the food. Yeah. Food is phenomenal. Very flavorful, right? Yes. Very diverse, I guess, as well. Yeah. Any dislikes? Something that could be better, maybe? No. No. I'm too new. You seem like an easygoing kind of guy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that, but I am. Uh, I have humility. That's, That's why I usually don't call out things that need to be changed. Because okay. I don't know. Yeah, no, exactly. Yeah. If you had to describe Malaysia on one word, what would you say? Uh, I like uh, the multicultural aspect. Mm -hmm. It's like a fusion of like lots of different Asian cultures. Yeah. So that would be my number one like. Is this a place you could see yourself retiring or probably not? I think it's pretty far from my family, so oh, maybe yeah. not. Sure. Awesome. Thank you so much for your yeah. time. Hi, what's your name? Ray. And uh, where are you from? I am from U.S. What brings you down here to Malaysia? Vacation and also trying to find uh, out if I want to move here for retirement. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, very cool. Why did you consider looking into Malaysia instead of the Philippines or other Thailand, something like that? I wanted something different. Mm -hmm. um, Thailand and Philippines, to me, are kind of similar. Okay. Um, when I looked it up, I looked at you know, YouTube. Um, I looked up uh, different websites to see, you know, the way people live, mm -hmm. how, uh, how they... Uh, The way the structure is, yeah. the infrastructure. Okay, of um, it's it's for for the cheap price. Yeah, it's you get a lot, you know. So I was like, yeah, I got to come. What are your first impressions so far? What do you think? I love it. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Um, I still have a, a couple other places that I want to go. I mean, because I have four years before I retire, so okay. I still have other places that I want to visit. Uh, but Malaysia is number one so far. Number one so far. Yeah. Okay. Any dislike? Something that could be better? Dislikes. Um, since I got here yesterday, I mean, <laughs> I haven't really seen. I mean, uh, the, the hotel that I stay in is, is beautiful. It's just, yeah. and it's uh, you know the people are so nice. You know, so mm -hmm. um, and since I've been here, I mean, the people are easy to talk to. Uh, they don't. They're not like uh, standoffish. Yeah. Um, they, they, you know, like if you ask them a question, they have no problem helping you out. Um, so, yeah, I have no, not yet. Yeah. It's only my second day. Not so, yet. It's the second day. It's long way to go, day. I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to be here till like the 24th. So, okay. yeah. You know, a lot of people would love to visit the U.S. or live in the U.S. and right. even retire in the U.S. Right. Why have you considered Asia? Well, me, myself, uh, so I'm 58. So, uh, me, um, I look at what America, as far as the economy is. Mm hmm and as far as how your money stretches when you uh, retire or yeah. how it doesn't stretch how about that so when i retire um if i fully retire or if i still retire i want my money to stretch i want yeah. my money to go farther okay. and it's to me here um it goes farther okay and lastly was there something that was completely unexpected for you when you arrived here and in your first 24 hours you. Me? <laughs> you weren't expecting to run into I didn't, me, huh? Yeah, no, I didn't expect to get an interview, but I mean, hey, I like it, so yeah. All right, well, thank you so much, man. I appreciate your time. All right. Thank you. Hi, what's your name? I'm Nathan. And yours? I'm Neil. Uh, where are you guys from? We're from America. What brings you down here to the, uh, I was going to say to the U.S., <laughs> what brings you down here to Malaysia? Oh, uh, we heard that there's like a lot of culture here that's very different from uh, the U.S., a lot of Asian culture and uh, we're from Asia too, like our heritage, so we wanted to check out other parts of Asia as well. Yeah, cool. so yeah, we just graduated, so we're on a trip like all over Southeast Asia. Yeah, sounds exciting. Have you visited any other countries before Malaysia or is this the this first is our one? second stop. We did Singapore. Okay. And yeah, we're kind of going in a circle all around like Thailand, uh, Vietnam, Indonesia, so okay. come around Southeast Asia. Yeah. Sounds wonderful. How long have you been here now? It's been like, like three 
Three days? Three days for him, and probably like five, okay. six days. So less than a week for both you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, tell me your first impression. What do you think so far of Kuala Lumpur? It's pretty good. The buildings are amazing. Uh, the architecture in Kuala Lumpur and Singapore is out as well. The Toronto Twin Towers, like, and uh, I think the 108, that, yeah. uh, that's where we're living near that. So we okay. get a view from our dorm, so it's pretty cool. Excellent. And uh, what do you think so far? Yeah, it's, it seems like a pretty cool, like, uh, lots of cool architecture, culture, food to try. Mm -hmm. yeah, it seems like there's a lot to do. Any dislikes? Something that could be better maybe for you? Dislikes? Uh, our bathroom, that's like our <laughs> dorm. Yeah. It's uh, okay. pretty small and like the shower is like on top of the toilet, so yeah, it's okay. a little difficult. But other than that, it's other than that, yeah. Cool, cool. Nothing for you either, huh? No. Nope. Have you had a chance to try some Malaysian food? Uh, we've been, uh, we're living in the Chinese, uh, district, so, like, okay. uh, mainly Chinese food so far, mm -hmm. but we're hoping to go to, like, uh, Jalon, uh, Lower Street, okay. and try the food there, so, yeah. Yeah. I highly recommend it. It's very busy, so try to go either a little early or a little late, so you skip okay. all that. But it'll be shoulder to shoulder with people, it'll be difficult to eat something there. I mean, it's good, there's that many people. Yeah, definitely, it's yeah. good, but <laughs> if you don't like crowds, you'll be a little turned off. Any advice for someone that's never been here, what would you say? Hey, we just got here, so we're just okay. getting used to it. But uh, I guess just embrace it. Don't be don't be scared of it being yeah. something different. Yeah, it's uh, like a lot of people from Western countries are scared of going to, I guess, more Eastern countries. Mm -hmm. But it's like culture is different. But I mean, don't be scared. Just like go for it. You got nothing to lose. Exactly. Just go for it, right? Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, nice no meeting problem. you. Thank you. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what do you think of the answers. Does anything surprise you? Anything you want to talk about that you agree with or you disagree with, if you take your time to write it, I'll take your time to respond. Now, for me personally, coming from North America, myself and Canada, we don't really usually hear about Malaysia for some reason. Whenever we hear about travel or vacation, it's usually like places like Thailand or the Philippines, even Vietnam, but for some reason, Malaysia doesn't get enough recognition. So I'm really glad to see a lot of people loving their stay in Malaysia, just like I have so far on my two trips. I'll definitely be three sometime in the near future. And the thing I like about these Americans is like they're very honest about it right and people coming to scout for retirement or just passing through and one thing I really want to mention I didn't notice too many Americans in Malaysia compared to some other countries for example when I travel to Thailand or the Philippines I see mostly American tourists when it comes to like foreigners or Caucasians or whatever but in the Malay in the Malaysia in Malaysia I noticed most of them tend to be either European uh, Australian a bit as well as Middle Eastern a lot of Arabic countries UAE Saudi Arabia places like that only a small fraction of American thus only having three or four interviews for this video itself so yeah that's it for this one guys don't forget if you're new to the channel just take a second out of your day hit that subscribe button hit that like button I'm making my way to 200,000 subscribers thanks to you guys and that's it so yeah share your thoughts i'd love to hear from you i'll catch you guys in the next video i have a couple more malaysia interviews before i move on to my next country and i'll see you guys next time bye